Hello, I'm Andrew Bartz, a director at Wesley Institute, and today we're here talking to Brian Cowling about education. Now, Brian, can you tell me a little bit about your current role? I'm the executive director of the Anglican Education Commission in the Diocese of Sydney. I've been in that position for the last couple of years. Before that, I was the uh, founding principal of an Anglican school in Sydney, and prior to that, uh, I spent several decades as a, uh, a teacher and an administrator in the New South Wales Education Department. And what are you tasked to do? What, what do you do is that, in that role? I'm involved in helping teachers and principals to, uh, to teach and lead Christianly. Now, there have been certain reports circulating around that, that says that we could be doing a better job of teaching Christianly. Has that been your experience? Within Anglican schools in particular, and no doubt in other schools as well, uh, we've not really thought through what it means to, to think Christianly and teach Christianly. Uh, we've often thought that it simply means just being nice to people and um, providing good care and, and so forth. What does it look like to teach Christianly? To, to think and teach Christianly is to uh, approach knowledge uh, in the recognition that God is the author of knowledge and that knowledge is something to be uh, explored and understood, uh, see how it all comes together, see how it, um, it helps us to understand what God's purpose was in, in creating us as human beings with the mind. And, uh, and so we want, to, we want to help teachers to, to think through the, the, the purposes behind what they're teaching. So what do you want people to be looking for when they consider postgraduate education? What people should be looking for in a course, uh, in a postgraduate course, is how is the, the learning I'm going to be encouraged to do, uh, both in its, its methodology, how I go about it, and the, and the substance of it, going to help me to have a, a more biblically based understanding of the subject and, and its purpose and develop the, you know, the critiquing skills that, that they often don't have. Uh, are there other things that, that we should be aware of that you'd like to, to just mention to us? I think we've just got to, got to help um, and encourage you know, many teachers to, to take up what uh, Wesley is offering uh, because I think once there's a critical mass of teachers in schools of whatever kind, uh, there's a healthy dialogue then. A lot of people don't seem to stand back and, and question the values that, that drive what they do. And so blindly we just accept consumerism, for instance, as a, an appropriate um, way in which to, to live our lives. Now, if we can help people to start to critique the curriculum, uh, they can also critique the life curriculum, if you like, that they're engaged in. So there's, there's a, a ripple effect, if you like, of starting to think Christianly as, as a teacher. And I would uh, think that the postgraduate courses that, uh, that Wesley has, uh, from talking to people who've done them, it has helped them on a new journey to, to come to terms with, with living.